I started running in 2015. My last race was three years ago and it was Shenzhen Marathon. It was my best time, my personal best. I did run the half marathon in one hour, 18 minutes. Thomas Royet has been living in Shenzhen for 17 years. He works for a French company in Shenzhen that specializes in baby toys. I don't think I will do as good this year, but just to be able to participate, it's uh, such a big joy. Thomas and Richard Howard have known each other for a long time. As friends, they often run together. Three years without race, so I don't know where is my level at the moment. So let's see, let's see, but I'm preparing for it. Uh, I want to do well. January I clocked up 388 kilometers for the month. So typically I run five to six days a week, plus strength training for legs. Uh, I did a good January with 270 kilometers. I improved, my level is coming back to what it was, uh, what it used to be. And uh, I hope that I will be ready for the Shenzhen Marathon. Um, my race PB is currently 316. Um, but hopefully working together with Thomas, hopefully we're going to run the first part together and I'm going to join him with my team and, you know, together you can run stronger and hopefully I can achieve that goal. Shenzhen Bay is my favorite place for running. It's beautiful. Uh, you can run 12 kilometers from Sheko to Rongshulin. Shenzhen is like a runner's paradise. I mean, you've got obviously the, the beautiful bay, which is long enough to train for long distance. For me, Shenzhen is home. I'm here for 17 years, so it's like running at home. I'm very familiar with the place. I don't do only running, I also go to the gym. Uh, it's circuit training, so I have some cardio training, some resistance training. All together, it should be uh, helpful for the race, yeah. It's relatively easy for Thomas to run a half marathon. With scientific arrangement of training routines, he could finish the whole race. My goal is to get the direct qualification for next year, so to run uh, below 1 hour 36 minutes for my age. Today is Lantern Festival, a traditional Chinese festival. Thomas and his family go to Sea World to experience the charms of traditional Chinese and tangible cultural heritages. He's very happy just running, so I'm glad he gets to find his habits and keep it for as a lifelong habit. He gets to go to a lot of places, and we also get to join him to places. Undoubtedly, with his family's support, Thomas can run further. <laughs> Today is the day to pick up the runner's packs. Thomas and Richard go to the Civic Center. They've gotten everything they need for tomorrow's race. In the early morning, 20,000 runners gather at the Civic Center to wait for their big day. We will be at the finish line, so do your best and don't get nervous. Bonne chance à tous les coureurs, à bientôt. Richard will cross the full marathon finish line at Chen Hai Stone Park, while Thomas 
will finish his half marathon race at Shenzhen Bay Culture Square. Running along the broad Shenan Boulevard brings Thomas closer to his beloved city. Amid rapturous cheers, volunteers are seen busy at refreshment stations. Countless cameras are trying to capture runners' moments. This is Thomas's biggest reward and experience. One and a half hours later, Thomas crossed the finish line and was greeted with cheers. This morning was so many people, 20,000 people. So it's good. It's good to see some friends before the game, after the game, during the race, to see the people on the road greeting for us. Shenmar, Zajem!